Okay, you know what? Just just wait for me. Let me quickly get quickly so we can so we can. Why? Why? I woke up early because I have an appointment. I know. I I'll I hurry up. No! No! Take Uber. I'll pay for it. I can't run late. <laughs> so it is true. That all men want is sex. And the moment you stop giving them that, they start misbehaving. Hey! Since you have brought this matter up, I'm not going to work again. Let's trash it right now. What are we trashing? It's sex food. When we were dating, I told you sex was my favorite food. Why marry me if you knew you were going to be a celibate? Fifth D. Marriage is for retirement. You hear me? Marriage is for retirement. As a young lady, you are going to date a lot of men and you are going to have sex with them. They will enjoy you. Different men with different penises, <laughs> they will break you. You will serve these penises because you are young and your body is still very active. But by the time you are ready to get married, you are tired. And even these men, they should be ready to hang their boots. So you see, D, marriage is not for sex. Marriage is for companionship and rest. Rest from all the sex that the cutlass men have gotten from me. So D, allow me to rest. rest. You hear me? Allow me to rest. Can you just hear the rubbish you just said? You are a full-time housewife with no education. When you were going to school, you told your parents that traveling is part of education. The school fees money they gave to you, you converted into traveling funds. That same mentality. You are unemployable, no job, no skills. The only skills you have is follow come. And that follow come is the sex you want to stop. Never. It can't happen. In fact, if you know you want to be a celibate, why marry me? Why? Why? It is me that you have reduced to an illiterate because of sex. You have reduced me to an illiterate. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay now. It's okay. I'm just pulling your hair. Yeah, don't you know when the man is pulling your hair? It's okay now. Nah. I don't have any skills. It's okay, it's okay, it's okay. I'm, I was just pulling your legs now. Nah. Okay, not okay. Illiterate. No, you are not an illiterate at all. I know what you want to say. Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Promise me that you're never going to say this again. Promise me, Father. Cross my heart. I promise you, I will never, never. Mm -hmm. Come on, man. <sighs> Silly. All you know how to do is to sleep. To sleep and sleep. Even though all I want is a baby. A tiny little weeny baby. Yeah, but miss. Yeah, 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 but miss. Oh, no, 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 did you just slap me. It's it's time to attack. What are we attacking? My eggs. Why are you Please. not getting naked now, D? Please allow me to sleep, woman. Oh, <laughs> 
Oh. Please come now. It's time to attack my sleep. eggs. This woman, leave me alone. No. no. Get up. Get up. Get up, You want pepper in your eyes. Don't you dare call my name. You can't continue to treat me as if I'm a weakling. I'm a man, B. He's a man. All day now. Have I been misled? What do you mean? What are you talking about? What are you doing? Oh, since I am married to a man and not a feeble, useless specimen of a man, how about you come and get me pregnant? Hmm? Since you are a man, come and get me pregnant! You can't be this crude and insensitive about this matter. Let me tell you something. You and your penniless life I'm not eating anything that I cooked with my money until I start missing my period. What? Yeah, what the? Yeah, 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 I thought yeah, you were doing it. Remember, I'm your husband. Here is all the love you preach. We've been married for 10 good years now. You can't just let that slide. Tell me what you told me that made me say yes to you in front of all those people. What does that matter now? It matters, D. It matters. Because how do you promise to give me a dozen children when you can't even get me pregnant? Twelve. In this Buhari country, don't you even know when a man is pulling your legs? When you die of ulcer, I will gladly go to your brother. And by the way, it's tradition. Never! Then get up and show me that you are a man, D. Show me that you are a man! Please, just give me small food now so that at least when I eat it, I have much energy to, you know, take care of your ass. Your mama will kill me faster than Corona. You better not be, be messing with me. Never! In fact, as you are looking at me now, the covenant of Abraham is flowing in my vein. Holy water! Holy water! <laughs> you promise? I promise. Baby, 
What? What, what? D, you're soft! Like, like, you're soft like spoiled dodo! Uh, 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 uh. That one's supposed to be my fault. Even car battery saved the fee. Well, not this battery. You hear me, D? Not this particular battery. And by the time I am done, this battery will be on and working perfectly. And I know that you think you can stop yourself by thinking of something horrible. How do you mean? Oh, please shut up. We'll see. Oh, please leave me. You better... Leave me, Jerry. I beg, leave me. Why? Ah! What did you do? What do you mean, what did I do? Am I biology? Mm, not at all. Ah. In fact, this is ah. chemistry at play here. Ah. So I ask you again, Dee. What did you do? Because I know how lazy you are. Ah. And all you love to do is sleep. And this lockdown has given you exactly that. Oh, God. Well, complain to my maker. And I'm still holding on to this. What say I give in to the compulsion to crush? Ah, ah, please, don't crush. Don't crush, please. Ah. One last chance, Dave. What did you do? Okay, 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 fine, fine. I I'll tell you, but just release my propeller a little. <laughs> Brassy, this propeller stays in my hands until I am ready unsatisfied. Now talk! <laughs> Small. What can be? Um, anyways, I am Nurse Anita and um, I am here to treat your husband. <laughs> you know what? <laughs> Don't bother about it, eh? I can't handle it. Uh, <laughs> come on, madam. You know, it is bad enough what you did to your husband. And now you're trying to deprive him of his um, treatment. That's not fair. Um, besides, I am the only available nurse right now during this um, COVID period. That's why I'm here. But, 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 but what is your mission? Please, you just tell me. Because I don't understand why you will be the only available nurse in the whole of your hospital. This is nothing personal. Um, please, can I treat your husband now or not? Okay. Yeah. Gladly. Thank you. <laughs> D, it's me. I know it's you, devil incarnate. Ah, ah, ah. Baby, please open the door. I should open the door so that you finish what you started. No, it won't work. Oh. 
D. Okay, D. I I'm here with the nurse that is going to treat you. You. Please get out. I don't want to see anybody. But Baby, don't you want to get better? Please open the door. The do I say get out. I don't want to see anybody. Okay. Uh, D. Are you by your phone? What about my phone? The nurse said she wants to send you something on your phone. I don't know what she wants to send. She said she has sent it. Please check it. Okay, okay, I'm coming right away. <laughs> Lord of mercy, I must be in heaven. heaven. Uh, uh, not yet, sir, but I'm very sure very soon. <laughs> Never! Uh? Not in this house! So, uh, 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 madam, I am just here to treat your husband. C can I can I go ahead? Sorry, ma. Um, sir, are you ready for your treatment? Born ready. <laughs> Let's get to it. <laughs> <Ooh>. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What kind of treatment is this one? I'm not hearing any sound of pain now. I hope something is it's not happening in there. Or D? D, baby, are you okay? D! What's even what did he say? Eh? I'm not supposed to be in there with my husband. Is stable now. What do you mean stable? And why are you licking your fingers? <laughs> it must have been um, some of the spilled syrup. I just hope you are not having some sort of ideas. Should I? No, should I? Because you walked in here all tidy and smart. Now you look like you have been riding a cow. Uh, um, 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 madam, it took me a lot of time to get your husband calm for me to, you know, apply the necessary massage. Which massage? Anita, where did you massage? Uh, uh, sorry? I don't understand. Uh, uh, I will beat you blue, black, uh, popular. Madam, I don't understand. Where did you uh, massage? Body! Hey. Hey. I want a divorce. Oh. Oh. Now, uh, what, what were you asking again? Hey, how could you? With that same hand of yours, you nearly ruined my generation. And still, you want to use it to disfigure our face? You know what? Don't even bother. You just wait until my lawyer gets wind of this. You see? You see? See? Don't, 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 don't come close to me. You will think it's, it's the other time that I was caught on a way. Don't come! Don't, don't, don't! Oh! So you want to fight me? Is that so? You want to fight me in my own husband's house? That's how. As that God knows what both of you have been doing inside the room. Just, 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 just look at you. Look at your face. Look at your lips. Madam, don't call me, you. Madam, don't call me. Madam, don't call me. Madam, don't call me. Madam, look at her. I say what? Say what? Oh no, sure. Come back here. And you, you are fainting. Oh, you are fainting, Abby. You are fainting. No problem. No problem. Ah! Ah! What kind 
of nurses this? Ah! What kind of nurse is this one? Oh, ah! I swear I did not do anything. I just woke up from a nightmare. Nightmare? Did yes, you just say you woke up from a nightmare? Yes, honey. I saw sex toys in Anita's bag. And you're saying it's a nightmare? How could you? How could you, D? I know that I could be hard sometimes. But all I wanted was a baby. Just a baby. But, but you! You! I swear it was a nightmare. Who said that bitch today won't drop? Oh, shut up! Are you sure? I'm sure. Are you sure you don't remember anything? Rat, rat! Rat, rat, rat! See you inside. Mm. Are you okay? Is there any problem? Hey God. Baby, did you have a bad dream? B tell me what is the matter? Good morning, darling. Good morning, dear. <laughs> Don't mind me. Um, would you like something to eat? Uh, no, I'm fasting. I 
I'm very sure that after last night you must be very hungry, aren't you? No, but I told her I'm fasting now. Is it by four? Huh? <sighs> Fast. <laughs> no, <laughs> lie lie. <laughs> that means you want to eat a bee? <laughs> yes, ma'am. <laughs> okay. Well, be how about we go inside so that I'll give you, <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> no. Why? See, you know, it is very good for a man to eat first before he eats. Don't you think? Yeah, I don't eh? think. <laughs> yes, I think so. <laughs> oh, that's better. <laughs> so just now, sit down here. Sit right here. Right here. Right here. Right here. Oh, oh. Sit down and go get you something to eat. Okay? Okay? <laughs> I'll be right back. what this woman is cooking today. Hey, Father, come and help me. Okay, um, one of you have to speak up. Be is it by force? Okay, um, how about you pretend that I am not a friend to your husband and I'm just here to kind of help you guys make up. Make up. Exactly. And who even said that we don't make up? I'm sorry, I'm lost. Then you better accept Jesus. Okay, how about um, I speak to you guys one at a time? How, how about what? Who is even paying for this? I hope you have not tampered with our joint account money because... Uh, 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 actually free, I mean... I am doing this to help my friend out here. Oh! He reported me to you, Abby? Well, <laughs> you reported me to Josie. Oh. You reported me to Josie! Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Josie, please, come and be going. Come and be going. The only thing you do for me, if I die in this house, sell all the lands in the village and will the money to my mother before this wicked woman... Your mother is a wicked woman! The mother that murdered the mother! Hey, 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 it's okay. Please. I, I'm just listen, I don't want to cause more fights here. All I want is Alright, tell you what, why don't I speak with him first? And then speak I'll speak with him first. Oh you want to speak with him first? Eh? So you think I don't know what you people are doing here? You think I don't know what you are doing here? You want him to speak first so that he will come and fill your head with life. No, 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 and no, 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 I can't do that. That would be very unprofessional. You are speaking with me first, and that is final. Okay, fine, fine, fine. I'll leave. That's better. So, um, <laughs> I hope you have a pen, because you're going to need a very long list. <laughs> man is as lazy as a pig. Even pigs manage to sell more than 20 piglets. She is wider than a GP tank. Most times I feel I'm entering an empty space. I have told him over and over and over and over again to go and enlarge his dick. But no, he, he won't listen. Hmm? His dick is as Small as a needle. Fat Josie. The worst part of it is she smells like fish. When I complain, she will say it's vagina discharge. And that means she's fatter. Can you imagine that? Josie, I really want to thank you for the help and tips. 
you gave to my wife. I really appreciate that. It's okay. Like I said, you know, it's something that she should know, and mm -hmm. she needs to work on herself. And you've got to give him a break, you know. Give him a break yeah. sometimes. Yes. Yeah. This is all about um, healthy, neat, a neat environment, you know, Please, for, yeah. for, for him to be able to produce healthy sperm. Exactly. You know? He needs to eat right. Yeah. You know, for him to produce matching so soldiers. Absolutely. That babies, you know? uh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm sure with all these talks that you must be very hungry, right? I, I, I don't think so. <laughs> Honey, <laughs> why don't you join me in the kitchen while we prepare something for our guests? I think that's a good idea. Excellent idea. You like a swallow? <laughs> that's great. Uh, we'll be right back. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Really? So apart from being a lying son of a bitch, not become a prophet of Yahweh. Hmm? So tell me, are you Elijah, Elisha, or maybe you are Ezekiel? Can you make your dry bones rise again? Honey, I know you love babies and... And? You do? Yes, I do. Good. So now that we know new ways to make these babies, why don't we show our appreciation to our guest? No, 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 no. There's no need for that. Why? Is he fasting? Uh, no. <laughs> so, um, let me go prepare the soup while you prepare the salad. Uh, no, 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 no. I'll prepare the soup while you prepare the swallow. <laughs> <sighs> I see you've learned your lesson. But you still don't know how to be quiet, right? Quiet? I didn't say anything that was in the truth. Uh, so, my thing, my thing smells like fish, Abby. Yeah, I was listening. But unlike you, hmm, I don't fall ill like a pig. And let me tell you something. You are going to suffer for this. Right now. I have a guest to fit. I'm so sorry we took so long. My husband and I are here. I got carried away. Right? Honey? Yes, darling. Trust me. Oh, I like a positive change after a long session. Mm. <laughs> Which was why I made you this delicious. Oh, it looks good. Mm. Smells good, too. Thank you. Uh, enjoy your meal. I will. My darling husband here will make sure that you do. Okay. Right? I'll be inside. Wait, wait. Let me test the food in case there is uh, pepper or salt is needed. Okay. Yeah. yeah. Go ahead. Mmm. Mmm. It's nice. Not bad, right? Mmm. I told you I could smell something a mile away. Something delicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay, do you need for the test, for the lab test to make sure it's right? Mm -hmm. Can I?
I'm sure you don't want some. <laughs> no, 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 not at all. Yeah. <laughs> this is my house now. It's yeah, you're saying that, but <laughs> your stomach is saying otherwise. You sure you don't want? Yeah, I can just have small. Yeah, yeah. small. <laughs> this is your house, man. They throw in the kitchen. You go and get some more from the kitchen. kitchen. All right, but ah, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Heavenly. My wife has never cooked like this before. Mm. <laughs> you see? Just like back in the day in school. Mm. When I used to give my answers. Mm. Mm. <laughs> mm. What delicious! <laughs> Heavenly! <laughs> Divine. <laughs> you can trust my wife on that. <laughs> Oh, it's just a token of our appreciation. I hope you enjoyed the meal. Oh, yes. Is there more? <laughs> now I can see why you both are friends. friends. Yeah. And yes, yes. There is more in the kitchen. If we can help yourselves while I run to the store to get some groceries. Yes, no problem. Okay. You had lady, get the more, you know. Yes, sir. <laughs> Still so meat, can't you? Know, like, yeah, you know what to say. <laughs> Hurry up, man. This guy's hungry. Like you, huh? <laughs> you do. I can't see that someone really <laughs> like. What 
Not today. Today? Not today. Good morning. Morning, darling. So you have decided, eh? Decided what? Is it not obvious? I've not woken up in this house without a slap and the smell of my mess. <laughs> Dear love. Don't be me! Especially when I know you want to kill me. What are you talking about? Who wants to kill you? Then why is everywhere smelling so nice? The burial song on the background. And why are you holding a weapon behind you? you? Instead of waking you up with a slap like I always do, whenever you pollute the sanctity of this house, I use this. What was I even thinking? Trying to make this one morning memorable and sweet for my darling husband. But no! I married a foolish man. If you want to be one of you. To be when this woman will behave well. Ah, I messed up. Ah. But now that I've found you, I'm safe. Was that supposed to be funny? Because you look like a chicken. Oh, I was simply trying to make you happy now. By dressing like a, a retarded village chief priest? Oh. Honey, that's too harsh now. Harsh? You haven't even seen harsh yet. Do you think you are going to know? I know it's a taboo for women to beat their husbands. But if you do not move from my front day, you will wish that Mr. Ibu was your father. Mr. Ibu? Mr. Ibu is actually my uncle from my mother's side. I'm simply trying to make you happy by preparing your breakfast. Here you are. Hey, Jesus. First, he says that Mr. Ibu He's his uncle. Now he wants to make a me breakfast. Yes. I used to work with him in his mama put before he became an actor. Ibu? Yes. Mama put? Yes. Okay. That's the kitchen. Mm -hmm. Just go in there and prepare something very nice for me. Yes, I will Actually, I, I want a fang soup. Mm. Mm. So make sure you make it very, very nice because I want to enjoy it. But I want to prepare you bread and tea. Ah, B. Me. Bread and tea. Yes. Dressed like this. Is that what you used to serve in Mr. Ibu Mama Put? Oh, come on, come on, come on. What do you know about cooking? You think it's this your Yoruba oily and pepperish food? I don't know why I want to strangle you so much, yet all I do is love you. you. <sighs> oh, who sent me a message? Me that cannot even cook rice without getting it burnt and one side brownish. She's telling me to go and make half a Okay, put some fire already. Mm -hmm. Okay. 
was too hard for you to make and you really 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 wanted to make your wife something couldn't you have made indomie
Exciting. So why aren't you looking happy? Be, we did it. I'm not looking happy because now that you are pregnant, I can finally divorce you. Read my lips. I'm done with you. D! <laughs> To tell you. Oh, what is this that is so important that you cannot wait in the morning? Do you wake up now? Eh? Eh? I had a dream. <sighs> a, a very tricky dream. I need to stop it. Very bad dream in Jesus' name. Mm. Amen. Amen. Oh, it wasn't a bad dream. Ah, then uh, let me go back to sleep now. Thank you, God. Oh. I dreamt that I, I, I married Adekunle and I divorced you. What? Then what happened to Simi's wife? She accepted me as a second wife. <laughs> God forbid that she accept you as a second wife. Why? You know that my dream always comes to pass. That's why I'm telling you. I'm, I'm worried. That's why I'm telling you to go back to sleep and rehab that dream. Don't wake up until Simi divorces adequately. Why now? What do you want to do with Simi's divorce? divorce? I already told you that she accepted me as a second wife. If you go back, you edit that part that she accepts you as a second wife. Edit it that she divorced Adekule so that she gets married to me. I don't want to edit anything. I like my dream the way it was. I like it like that. Uh, see, I, I mean, I'm just telling you this because I don't want you to wake up tomorrow morning and start looking for me. Oh. You, you can wake up now, you find that I've packed my things and moved to my new husband's house. Aha! House. Uh -huh. can see somebody is trying me tonight. Hello? Hello, Pastor? Hello, Pastor. Hello. Hello. Hello, Brother D. How are you? I'm fine, Pastor. Pastor, sorry to bother you this hour. 
I'm calling you so that you pray for me for quick deliverance. Deliverance from the spirit of anger. Pray that I don't beat and kill my wife tonight. Bro, calm down. Take it easy. Don't, 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 don't beat your wife or... Eh? I had a dream about your wife. In the dream, you gave her gave one dirty slam and she died. Three days later, in that same dream, I saw you remarried. You married one superstar musician they call See. Ready? Uh, uh, Pastor, uh, what about, about Adekunle? What happened to Adekunle in the dream? Oh, sister, how are you? Um, Adekunle, Adekunle agreed to have your husband as second husband. <laughs> Pastor, you are really anointed. <laughs> Good night, Pastor. <laughs> but what can I do without my love? I need you, baby. I need you, my heart. What is that for? I want water. You want water? Yes, room temperature. B, you burnt me with lighter because you want water. So you prefer the slaps now, B? Who said a pregnant woman cannot get herself water? And who said a pregnant man should sleep like a corpse? Am I pregnant? Yes, we are both pregnant. Now, if you don't want me to burn this house down with, with, with this lighter, go and get me water. Fine, fine, fine. I will get you to water. Water! Give me water! Oh, okay, you get water. I'm getting the water for you now. Go! You're not moving fast enough! <laughs> Here, yeah, take your water. This was not what I asked you for. But you said you wanted water. No, I said water and snacks. Oh, what your baby eats. And I asked if you wanted anything else. Yes. And I expect a father to be to know that he should get snacks for his baby. Please go. Okay, okay, fine, fine. Go and get me snacks. Go and get me snacks. Fine. What kind of husband is this? <laughs> Now, here is your snacks and water. Eat and let me rest, please. Ah. Are you not going to pour me water? After bringing you the snacks and water, you I should pour, pour you the water. water again. I still have my life. Oh, okay, 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 fine. This is a no good rest for this house. Have your water. I don't want. It's, it's too crunchy. See, I want something soft and subtle. You said you wanted water. And now, water and snacks. I brought you water and snacks. You don't want snacks. You wanted something. I want something soft! I want something soft! Be your father! What? Your father should go and do it. Fat, I'm tired of this nonsense. Idiot. You don't even know that it's, it's KFC donut that I want. You better go. I want KFC donut. I want KFC donut. You better come back here. Come and give me KFC donut. Oh. Mm. What is it now? Well. 
I was arranging some clothes. And then I realized that I, I love the, the smell of clothes being ironed. Ironic, right? Not ironic, it's demonic. I'm thinking why I did not run away years ago. Look, D, I'm not in the mood for all this, so. All I want is for you to take this iron from me now and iron all these clothes. I want to sniff them. Which clothes? I want you to, to iron them back and forth. And when you're done, eh, you iron the, the, the curtains and then the bed sheets. And maybe even this one that I'm wearing. <laughs> D. D, where are you? D. Oh, baby, we got to take it slow 